saying, hey, guys, we're back. Um, reconnected. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. We are reconnected. Okay, so we've got the um, uh, the psi all um, dialed in. All right, so now we're going to work on the cloud. And um, uh, we'll start up here first, and then just, just like before, we'll work our way down. Um, I may not. Um, you are now clear. Please alert. Hey, I'm talking here. Um, so right now, when you, when you squint, you know, kind of value-wise, you guys are kind of close, yeah? So we're going to, we're going to change that a little bit, um, and, uh, and make it a little bit, uh, well, you could go darker than the blue or lighter than the blue, but we'll see what you can do that. What you don't want to do is have it be kind of like the same. And I think maybe what we want to do is uh, go a little bit uh, lighter. Because the, by going lighter, it, it would uh, serve as a uh, better contrast to the mountains that are dark. So again, there is a purpose. So we are going to go with what are we going to go with? We're going to go a little indigo. Oh, we didn't use indigo before. <laughs> I was worried if it was going to come out to play. Well, I tell you, um, we, we try to not have mm -hmm. worrying as a part of our uh, things that we deal with. But, um, well, that was for the sun, yeah, so maybe that's the reason is that we're going to use it for the, uh, the sky, I mean, the cloud. We don't want it to be the same family, but it's really, really light, yeah, so. Test it some more. Okay, that's lighter. We and then no, let's make it a little bit more. Put more color, more violet, more cowbell.
Okay. So now if you guys are paying attention to what we have done previously and what we're trying to do now, this part right here is from the under <coughs> painting from many, many days ago. Okay, so that's all dry. The sky, the blue sky, we just put that on today. And then I left uh, uh, the, the clouds alone. So now we're going over the clouds now. Um, and I decided to uh, make it you know, more, more on the, the, the gray, grayer than the previous underpainting um, to uh, separate it from the cloud, uh, the skies even more. Uh, Value-wise, yes, it's a, it's a little bit lighter. Not, not drastically, but just a little bit. And if you decide that you didn't want it to be like this the way I'm doing it, that's uh, acceptable. All right, you, you can you can decide what looks good to you. But at least you know why I did what I did. Okay, and you can decide to. Uh, or you want to ad lib um, and and go on your own? That's fine too. Okay, it's your it's your vision. Uh, and, and that's what matters. The reason I'm doing this is I'm trying to tone it down a little bit because I don't want this to um, get a lot of attention because I want a lot of attention down here, okay? Uh, so I don't want to create a competition unnecessarily. This is a good time to paint on air before it, it, everything dries up because the, the blue sky is a little on the tacky side. And so by uh, getting up to the edge where the blue sky is on, you, you kind of have a natural blend. Um, you can soften the edges, all right? And so it's not, I mean, right now it looks really harsh, right? Okay, but once I rework all of this, uh, it should get softer. The edges should get softer, kind of like what's happening here. Right, as I uh, paint this area and I'm encroaching into the area that uh, was the sky, it will naturally uh, soften that edge. Okay, so that's, that's in your favor. Right? So you're, you're snagging a little bit of that blue, that blue sky. That's a favorable thing. That's not a mistake. No, not that one. Yeah, no. <laughs> She's like, shut up, man. <laughs> okay. Okay, so it's nice. Nice and soft. The edges are nice and soft. That's uh, exactly how you want them. Oh, yeah. Better than I thought. <laughs> Damn, you're good. Yeah. Oh, that was amazing earlier. <laughs> now, I'm amazing and conceited. <laughs> <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> no, we don't celebrate that. That's the fault that you fix. <laughs> You gotta give up one of them. Hopefully I don't need to fix it. <laughs> Hopefully you get rid of the right one. Not, not the amazing part, the conceited part. When people always tell you, didn't they say you did a good job? I said, I don't need anybody to tell me a good job. Yeah. I got myself. <laughs> <laughs> they could have told me anything. I can tell myself whatever I want. And then when I am encroaching into the area that is the blue sky part, um, and then it, let's say you're doing the same thing, just be careful that you don't lose uh, shapes, yeah? You still want to uh, maintain the shape of the clouds. You just want to soften the edge. So 
So that's what you're doing is softening the edge of the clouds so that they blend into the sky. Well, they don't look um, hard. yeah, you don't want to use the word blend because that could be misleading. What you want to do is soften okay. the border between the, the, the sky and the cloud. So, but there is a border, but that border is soft, Got it. not a hard edge. No. Wow, it's freezing in here. I'm using the two oh. in the loft, remember? Yeah. And they're perfect. Yeah, they work. <laughs> oh, yeah. Have you ever painted something that um, feels like Maui? Uh, you know how like a lot of your pieces are, you know, definitely feel like Nepali coast and mm. you get a sense of Kauai. Is there mm. anything that you do that's typically Maui? Well, in the early days, I would do actual seeds in Maui, mm. like Iao Needle and all mm -hmm. that. Yeah. But um, I, haven't, I haven't spent a whole lot of time in Maui exploring since the 70s. Oh, wow. Well, I'm busy doing other stuff. Yeah. So, comes a point that the exploring days are over. They made me think of Kauai. Yeah. Well, and then I good. thought, oh. Good, because that's that was the point.
there was this guy that was on uh, my Instagram that you know would uh, all uh, would look at some of my moonlight pieces, like Tropical Cascades and that and the other, whatever moonlight. And this comment is always like too dark. Oh, that's it. That's it. And I would say mahalo. <laughs> And uh, so he's done it twice, and I would just thank him, right? And uh, then he would, uh, uh, one, uh, one time, not both times, but the first time he replied with maybe two question marks, like he didn't understand why I... Thanked him for his comment? Yeah, because I, I'm not thanking him because it's favorable. I'm thanking him for sharing his comment, mm -hmm. right? But I'm not going to argue with you. Yeah, <laughs> if, if it's dark for you, it's dark for you. But, but I'm, like I said, I'm... But even, I'm just thanking you for chiming in. He confused. He, he got confused. Uh, yeah. Like, what? I guess that's not the response he was looking. He's like, I guess. He's looking for a debate. A defense, yeah. Yeah. And then the, a debate, right? Uh, luckily for him, I didn't. It's funny because at night, things are dark. So, again, you know. Again, again, right? Because uh, <laughs> I, I, uh, I, then, then I looked at his stuff. Uh, <laughs> okay. Now you know. Well, you know, uh, it's like, yeah, your your comment doesn't have to be favorable. No, but I appreciate you making it. <laughs> it. It doesn't matter to me if you think it's too dark. You're right. Whatever. I think it's subjective. I'm not, I'm not gonna argue with you about what you think. No, if you think that, that's your honest opinion, then go. <laughs> but so far, he hasn't responded to the second one. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have a bunch of cake boxes that are um, sitting around, or <laughs> they have to be made? Tell, tell me, tell me your situation. I was thinking instead of making Mary Jean drive up here, if you had four ten by twenty cake boxes available, I could bring those to her. It doesn't have to be a cake box. Right? What, do you, what does it have to be? It just has to be face to face space with a spacer. Oh, okay. Yeah, we can staple those together. I could bring them to her and she can take them to print logic. Yeah. Because the, the, uh, our uh, cardboard supplier is out of stock. Yeah. No, oh, I believe that. Well, so you, know about, you know about supplies. I do. Supplies. Boy, these bowls are so gorgeous. <laughs> I know, you got the good one. Do you want that one? No, no, no. I'm just saying, you know, even though that thing got a chunk missing, that didn't take away from the fact that it's a good one. Why did you like that one? Because it was broke. I didn't want to take a good one. I just said the two. I think I like the shape. I mean, between, I was only wanted a broken one. So, well, because you have, you can have all the nice ones. I don't, I don't need No, like I said, that, that one is not particularly a bad one. Like I said, yeah. once, once that thing, it's actually going to have the je ne sais quoi. It will. <laughs> Whatever that is, it I want two of those. Better not cost me more than a bowl. <laughs> no. Well, the thing is, it, it, the thing was free, so. <laughs> That's where I'm already ahead. <laughs> what are you doing? Yeah, and then these are dyed. So to get some of the color, I think this one, or there was an orange one. Huh? They, he dyes them. Really? But, yeah. 
I have to ask, so um, some are dyed. This is a nice thick one. Um, I have to look at the titles of what they are. Maybe somebody bought one of the orange ones. But that's all pine, yeah? Uh, yep, Norfolk Island pine. Yeah. yeah, they're nice. They're very nice. Where are you going to put them? I haven't figured that out. I was looking around. I'm going, you know what? With the with their um, uh, diameter. Yeah, they take up both uh, ways. Yeah, the footprint is kind of big. And plus, I'm thinking of putting something, a weight, on the bottom of it. Because the base is so small that, you know, if something were to happen, it would throw off the balance. So yeah. if it was weighted on the bottom, right, just put maybe... Um, uh, I'll get uh, Rami to uh, fix up like a bag of something, put some sand in it, or maybe just even a, um, a, a baggie. Mm -hmm. Fill it with sand, seal it up, and then it's, it's got some weight, and then just put it inside of it. So um, could, would you maybe make a shelf by a window so the light would come through them? Well, I might, I might put it in the house Ooh. where the light can mm -hmm. come through, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. But I, I just really did not have the kind of time I wanted to think about exactly how I want to do it. I wanted to, first of all, get your towels back to you. I did get those. You did? <laughs> yeah, okay. those are that pile of towels. See, so everyone can know what we're talking about. Here's a really beautiful bowl. Uh-huh. This one's awesome, too. They're all great. They're all great, look at that. Oh, I feel a crack in this one. I think that's the one with the crack. Oh, oh, I and mean, then I could have had this big tall one. That could have been my choice. Uh, that's the one with the crack. Oh, that's a nice looking one too. They're really they're nice. All, they're all great. Yeah. I didn't drop them, but I did wreck them. <laughs> Somehow, you're not off the hook when you say you didn't drop them, no. knowing you. I didn't drop them, but I am responsible it's for the like, It's like, um, they, they may not have actually been as damaged if you did drop no. them. I, I actually thought that I, um, I, I was trying really hard to pack them because I remember, you know, the artist saying they're delicate, you know, and, yeah. and I was thinking like, okay, I thought I did a good job and I had a bunch of foam in there and, but... It's not, Obviously it's not, not. Well, no, it's it's how it's going to be handled after. True. Right? Once the. Yeah, but once it leaves it. you, what are you going to do, right? Yeah. So basically, you're, you're trying to uh, pack with that in mind, yeah? They, they get a little rough. But yeah, I would uh, see if, uh, what's his name? Sid. Sid? Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. That if, if he can turn you on to those bow tie things, that would be so awesome. That would be really awesome, actually. Yeah, you don't even have to put the crack back, um, the piece back in. You could do something from afar to attach them, even like a... That, but since you have the thing, I would just, go, oh yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, the other way is that, you know what, if that was like a natural part of the wood, mm -hmm. Nothing fell off. It just came that way. Right. Yeah, because then uh, it's all, you know, the edge of it oh, would have been natural. yeah. It looks like a break as opposed yeah. to nature's right. break. Right. So, and you have the piece that came off of it. So, it's perfect right. for the other type, right? And there's nothing wrong with the other type. The other way is that the one that I showed you was basically, mm -hmm. that was the natural formation of the wood. And it got in the way of the design of the piece. So, uh yeah, you're not. You're just playing it up, mm -hmm. right? Yours is uh, repair. The other one was not repair. It's just basically so that maybe it won't get worse, you know, just because there's a split there. And I wouldn't be surprised if he's done something like that already. Oh yeah. Right. Which. 
uh, you would hope that he has because then that would be awesome. He's not doing it for the first time. Mm -hmm. trip is going. Um, where did she go? Uh, California. To the same place she was before? Um, not, sh oh, not, no. not sure. But no, she said she had like potential art oh. leads in um, gallery or something in, in, the, in, the, in a winery or something like that. So that would be nice. nice. Yeah. And then she's got like family business that she had to deal with or take care of or be a part of. Your, your time frame is 1.30, you said, right? Um, maybe 1.15. 1.15, okay. Yeah. What's that other painting over to your left? Not the green one, but the little colored one? What is that size? Is that a 10 by 20? Oh, yeah, it looks like. Yeah, was that something you just started and just aren't involved in right now? Yeah, I'm not sure. I think that that may have been um, uh, a rough of a possible uh, Ooh, commission. Gotcha. What I'd like to see after this piece is a horizontal diamond head sunrise. Uh-huh, me too. Yeah, I think that would be awesome. Oh, it will. <laughs> it will be I awesome. I think you're, you're, you can be dreaming of that one. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I got, I got a lot that... Uh, That's still in I, there? I, well, yeah, I, well, I, I, one of the things is I want to uh, do Dave Morris's Kicks too, so he can have his painting back. Okay. So we're basically just um, getting a lighter version of this color that I had uh, painted the, uh, gone over the underpainting with. But, so this is just to add little volume so it's not very flat looking, yeah. And, um, and of course, as I'm doing this, it's mixing, the, the, the paint is mixing with the wet paint underneath. So that's, that's a good thing so that um, uh, it's, it's not uh, consistently the, the same color that I started with and it makes for a nice soft blend within, within the cloud formation.
I can't believe it's August. <laughs> it's fast, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, you should, you should feel it from where I am. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe it's 2021. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah. yeah, some people say, I can't believe it's already Monday. No. Uh, that's nothing. Can't believe it's and Mondays August. blend together. A Friday is a Saturday is a Sunday is a Tuesday. It's all a day. Like I said, but with me, my my thing that I notice is the year. Oh yeah. Like you're, you, you're noticing the month. Yeah. Some people, it's the day. Right. What's well, already? It's already Thursday. Uh, That's nothing. It's already one o'clock. That's nothing. My day is not cool. No, when you're a mom, you do your whole day at work, and then you go do your whole day again. Well, again, some people are clock watchers, like, oh, it's already 4 o'clock. Okay. That, that's where you're at as far as gauging your time. It's actually the clock. thinking if you put um, like a diamond head for the calendar, some diamond head in the calendar would be nice. I don't think we've had a shot a diamond head in there in a while. Mm, yeah. Probably not. But um, might not have one in time. Well, no, you have you have those um, five by sevens. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, you have them, right? Yeah. IMP. I don't know if I want to take one away from Tom to go have it scanned though. Oh. Just go ahead and spit it out. What are you trying to say? <laughs> Those are unavailable for research. <laughs> uh, so I should do a 9 by 12 is what I should do. Is what you're saying. Might right? as well. No, oh, I'm, I'm glad you brought that up. <laughs> I might have to go I was going to say uh, something, but uh, since you brought it up. I might have to add that to your list. My list is growing. And you won't be able to stack anything because I got papers everywhere. Hey, just like I said, hey, just, you know. Write them up. Write them up. Get them done. Yeah, for those of you guys who are watching, this is the way it works around here. <laughs> there's only one boss. And then there's the painter. <laughs> <laughs> talking about at the airport you cannot accept any other outcome except for the one that needs to be that's a good that's point that's that yep that's that whatever you gotta do that's what you gotta do yep all the time and that makes you a good boss all right oh did we put i have to look in the do you have an old calendar i mean a current mm -hmm. calendar i wonder if dreams was in there i can't i mean it must have been it was made oh was it it totally has to be. Let's 
see. Where am I looking? The desk? No. Oh, okay. Right there? No, you passed it. Is there one there? No? Oh, yeah. Dick Blick is covered. Oh, sorry. Another one. Just found them. That's great. I wonder, oh, but you know, you scanned it before we sent it to Maui, right? Of course. Remember? That's the scan right there. Yeah. No, no, no. Um, dream. Oh, dreams. I don't know. About dreams or the dream? No, the dreams. Dream. Dreams, yeah. Uh, I'm not sure. Um, I feel like... Um, no, maybe not. I feel like we didn't scan it. Yeah, maybe not. We, but it took a while to ship it over there. So was that because it was getting scanned? No, I remember it was on the easel. Yeah, yeah. All that time. Yeah, I think we missed that. Yeah. We missed the whole thing. But that really pretty, that 12 by 16 is kind of a moonlight. So we could use a, maybe a harvest moon. Do you like painting those? <laughs> Golden. What does it matter what I like painting? <laughs> <laughs> You're telling me what you need. Yeah. I get my diamond head in there. And let's see. So we need a moon, a diamond head and a moon. What else do I need? Oh, we only have one rainbow. Do you want to add another rainbow? Put it down the way you need to put it down. Basically, with those needs in mind, I'm not a beggar because we might, uh, we'll just work on whatever you've got coming up for the other galleries when just mm -hmm. scan them mm -hmm. because that we're going to be more in a rush to get those probably by the next no, couple I know. weeks. I know. Yeah. So whatever, whatever you come up with, we'll scan. It, it'll be good. Even that, that little golden one's really pretty right there too. The, but it's uh, frame? small. Yeah. Yeah, I still got to fill that order, right? Yeah, I haven't given it to you yet. Oh. We're, we're, we have, they're, they're okay on time. Okay. But no, but I thought it was up to me. It or, is. It is. Um, so, yeah, I'll just, I'll give you the information. Then if you feel like doing it, something that's one what day. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. It's like, it's like uh, have it there ready. the old two birds thing. Oh, they would love that. Well, again, right? I mean, it, it fills that order and, yeah. and uh, if, it, if it serves another purpose, better yet.
Okay, good. Very Jean will take the stuff to print logic. Okay. So you want to leave with those now? Today? Yeah. Okay. What how long does it take you to put them together? Maybe ten minutes? So did those guys start at the uh, company Kauai? Today. Today? Yep. They called me this morning and I called security to let them know. Uh -huh. And uh, okay. and then they, they called me this morning to say that they're there. Mm. And I said, if you want to rip out the carpet in the back rooms, if you need to do that, we're on board with that because mm -hmm. we'd have to do that anyway. Mm -hmm. And they said, okay, so maybe they will do it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so nice. it's exciting. It's getting going. Yep. Let's see how reasonable those guys are. Yeah. It's too bad it's not the guys that we've been dealing with. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. This guy was really nice. I met no, him, no, no, but... No. Um, no, no, no. The management. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, and if it was uh, Jeff. Yeah, right, yeah. Jeff, it would be easy to deal with. Oh, yeah. Totally different. and change the colors on it. Um, the partition? The partition in the center that each oh. section is painted a different color. Uh -huh. uh, we could do that. I mean, you could do it anytime anyway, but just to make it feel a little different and fresh. Yeah, yeah. And I think probably we'll just, um, maybe when the, the guys over there, Kent has countertops, so we can either, you know, bust out the countertops we have and mm -hmm. Kent can go in and... Oh, from you, Dean, you mean? Yeah. Mm. And he said if Dean's busy, I think he, had, he told me a name of another guy. Um, oh. He said that name first, so it wasn't resonating with me that uh, he worked for Kent. Oh. Because he said, or, you know, Dean based on his schedule. So then I realized he was talking about another one of his people. Uh-huh. Yeah, whatever. Whatever. So what about, um, have you thought more about the food? I have an ad out okay. now. Um, so Belle is still on board for her two days and, um, and Grace is on board. And then um, when I most recently, about two weeks ago, maybe it's three by now, um, I had talked to Lisa, but there she had been somewhere in Kauai remote, right? Where you don't get signals. And then she had just come off the hill and it seemed, I had texted her a couple times, mm -hmm. but there was a death in her family. And so she was oh, taken yeah, off yeah. to the mainland. Her uh, uncle, uncle, Michael. Is that dad's side, mom's, mom's side. side? Yeah, so she was leaving. So um, yeah, she, we're not, yeah. not ready anyway. 
she was scattered. Uh, yeah, uh, Carol's uh, favorite brother. Oh. Yeah. But that must have been a while ago because that, that happened a while ago. I think that was right around the time when we were moving out, right? Just a couple weeks ago. Maybe like that, because uh, uh, when, oh, yeah. when when I uh, spoke to Marty about mom, then um, uh, Carol was still there oh. uh, for the funeral for her brother. Oh yeah, so I think it, it maybe it was over right before the weekend of when we moved. Mm, maybe because I think I told her like, wait, this is what we're doing now. You know, like giving her the updates of where we're right, at. Right, right, right. Even when I um, spoke to Boko about that, um, she thought you know your your ideas about the other people were, was okay. Oh, yeah. So I said no, okay. Because usually she would take the other position, right? Right. But, you know, she was like, yeah, maybe for a couple of days, and be, but then I said, you know, the conflict. Yeah. The thing is, yeah. I mean, I get that too, but and everything you're saying, I agree with a hundred percent. But, my but is that, is it, I, all of that is true. With the right person, it's true. With the, the other kind of person, it might not ever even come into play because they're not, they won't connect their own dots. <laughs> That's what I'm counting on. <laughs> no, but you have to worry about the other side too. If they would think that that's a conflict. True, right, right. Yeah, they might have an issue with it. But yeah. if you, yeah. Correct. Reduce my hours so much that I am forced to go look for other business and then you're going to tell me what kind of business I can look for to work. But I, I, I do I do get it because, you know. No, but that's the thing, yeah. yeah. It's uh, that's the old, um, it's the old dynamics again, right? Well, and I'm, I'm more counting on the, uh, you know, the people come back and then they f remember how much they love being back, too. Sure. No, no again, the, the, the old dynamics is you as the worker has no power. You have no power whatsoever. It's what gets dictated to you. Right. Right. The new, the new dynamics is that uh, what if nobody shows up for work? See, the owners never thought of that because you're used to the old dynamics right. where you can always get somebody. Now it's not true. Now it's not true. And, and I like that. I like that because that uh, leads to more consideration of each other. Mm -hmm. Instead of one-sided, you're dictating to that, the other side all the time and they right. have zero power. I love it when it's more equal. That way, you can, you're can you more likely to arrive at something that's... Uh, fair to both sides, mm -hmm. right? And I love that. Why, yeah. why would somebody be against that, right? To be fair on both sides, right? It's kind of like, you know, even with, um, uh, well, mostly it's uh, Texas and Florida, right? With the school, with the kids with the mask, okay? Or no mask, mm -hmm. right? And uh, the governor of Florida was, you know, threatening to, uh, you know, not fund the schools or withhold the teacher's pay, whatever, blah, blah, blah. And um, so that is a, um, uh, that's a, uh, like a, like a uh, sort of a legitimized way of uh, blackmail, right? I will withhold your pay if you don't do as I say, okay? 
and he's used to the old dynamics where you can do that. And everybody goes, oh, shit, I need the money, so I better show up, right? right. But now they're going, okay, what if we all collect them and say we're not going to show up? And send the kids to school, whatever, never mind which side you're on. Right, right, right. right. Mask or no mask, doesn't matter. The point is, you are dictating to a certain group to do as you do your bidding, whether they like it or not, right? And I don't like that. I don't like that. I like it when uh, uh, power and fairness is uh, distributed in such a way that you count the opinion of the other side, mm -hmm. right? And you take that into the thing and work out another way instead of a dictatorial type of uh, arrangement right. where you have zero choice, you will do as I say or suffer the consequences. I don't like that because that puts a lump in everybody's throat. Right. Right? And that's that's how you get your staper stolen. Right. right. <laughs> <laughs> and and how good is the teaching gonna be from these when you're under fire, when you're when, unhappy. When you're, when you're unhappy, how in the world are you gonna perform your best? And who's at stake? The kids. Yeah. Hello? And it, you know what I mean? You know, never mind which side you're on. Just know what's happening when you do it that way, right? It's better to just say, you know what? You know what? I'll, I'll take into account what you're saying. Let's work out something. Mm -hmm. Instead of you're going to do it my way or I'm going to cut. And, when, and you know, and they, we did that with Japan, right? And then Pearl Harbor happened, right? We cut off their oil, right? You don't do it like that. Cut off their oil. And they didn't realize. You know, Japan took it. You're, you're trying to choke us to death. Right. So well, we can't stand around for that to happen. Right. right. Again, it's that that mentality. You know, and given the the right kind of people, you you arrive with a good a, a good solution that is uh, fair and uh, and it's with dignity to the other side. Mm -hmm. So whichever side you are, you will you will keep your dignity. Mm -hmm. That has value. And then there's this one uh, uh, teacher that did speak up about that and just basically said, well, you know what, um, go ahead, take my pay. I'm not going to do it. You know? And, and uh, it breeds contempt, yeah, when, when you threaten somebody with something like that. Right. Yeah, it doesn't make you more endearing. You might follow them, but man... Well, again, at some point, you know, when you need a favor, and don't count on that guy.
turning out. Good. Yeah, you know what? I think, you know what? We better tell everybody what I'm going to do is, uh, even though we're short on time, on uh, being able to uh, do more today, we're about ready to call it a day. I'm going to keep on going anyway, so the next time you see it, it'll be further along. But I will not have changed uh, any of what I've told you uh, before, all right? I'm still going to uh, apply all the things I told you of what I'm doing, okay? But I'm just going to take it further along because we're really pressed on time as far as all the schedule is concerned. So if we wait, uh, you know, another week or so before uh, uh, I continue on this, um, we, might, we might miss some of the uh, deadlines that, that we wanted to uh, uh, meet. And, um, but it, it's not as if you're going to miss out on anything because, uh, and if there was something that uh, I need to uh, do that we didn't cover, then I won't do that in all fairness to everybody that's just been uh, following. Um, so that way, if you're, uh, just in case you're doing something similar to what I'm doing as, as you're listening, then uh, you won't get lost. Promise. Okay. Okay. So, I think we better um, sign off over here. Okay, it's one o'clock. Thanks for joining us today as we resume um, this project right here. We appreciate all the questions, all the comments, the jokes, mm -hmm. um, especially some of the really good ones. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and continue this, and um, uh, I, I think you'll like uh, the, the the outcome. Um, but I parts of it is is uh, while the uh, the sky is wet, I, w I wanna I wanna be able to uh, uh, do the clouds, and it, it'll just work out better. So you know, but don't ever feel that you're you're gonna miss out on on anything at all. Okay, and uh, before, uh, when, we, when we see each other again, I'm going to go over the stuff anyway, and you'll, you'll realize that I hadn't done anything that I hadn't already told you, okay? All right, so from, uh, say goodbye, Ann. Aloha, everyone. Okay, and uh, we'll see you next time. All right, have a great week, everybody. Aloha.